fluffy people, it's your girls, Jordan and Joelle, and you're watching A Double Dose. We have your three hot topics in under three minutes. Ready? Let's go. Okay, the first hot topic in today's news is our other favorite sisters besides ourselves, and that is Serena and Venus Williams. The Wimbledon is going on, mm -hmm. and Serena did beat out her older sister to take advance the next step to the quarterfinals of the Wimbledon. But of course, in true sisterly love, as soon as she was finished, she took right to Instagram to post about it, saying yeah. that she loves her sister, that it's just all fun and competition, and they might not get many more moments like this because right. of their age, but Venus did kind of combat that with saying that they are not done with tennis yet, and so we can definitely expect more from the Williams sisters. Yeah, well, more people who posted as uh, social media conversations back and forth, they always think it's so funny when people see each other every day, <laughs> converse on social media are Tamar Braxton and Jeannie Mai, of course. We all know both of them as being co-hosts of The Real. And Jeannie Mai has been under a little bit of fire lately for sticking with the Miss USA and Miss Universe uh, pageants. Mm -hmm. She is going to be uh, one of the co-hosts. And despite Donald Trump's recent racist remarks, she is still going to take on that role in the next coming weeks. I believe it comes on July 12th. So she'll be on the show. And Tamar Braxton did not really agree with what Jeannie, with Jeannie Mai's decision. And she took to Twitter and said, wait, what? No ma'am, at Jeannie Mai, you tried it. Have several seats, hashtag GTFOH. And then she kind of went back and uh, can, of course people were saying, you know, don't say that to her, why are you being so mean to her, things like that, because the two don't really agree very often on the show. Yeah. And Tamar said, I'm just saying to her what I would say to her if we were at work. It's nothing that I wouldn't say to her in person, so don't make it more than it is, she's not trying to start a war. Right, so uh, I give it to Tamar, yeah. I, I, have, I have to say. Mm -hmm. But and also Jeannie Mai, we have to say Jeannie Mai says she's not taking a paycheck for her position as co-host. She will be she will be taking the paycheck, but she'll be donating it all to a charity of her choosing. Okay, well, and she has had several reasons as to why she's staying with the pageant. Right. But our third hot topic is a little bit of a heartbreaker, but I think we all saw it coming. Kourtney Kardashian and Scott Disick have called it quits. Now, the two have three children together, Mason, Penelope, and now Baby Rain. And after this past weekend, Scott was seen partying and living it up in the south of France with his ex-girlfriend, yeah. and that was just the end of it for Courtney. It's all reported, but of course, both E! Online, Glamour Magazine, and Us Weekly have all reported it. So those yeah. are pretty reliable sources for, for this entertainment news. Yes, so we'll see what happens in the coming weeks. <laughs> yeah, well, that does it for us with our hot topics. Of course, you can follow us all week long Facebook.com slash Jordan and Joelle online, Instagram at Jordan and Joelle, and Twitter at Jordan and Joelle. I'm Jordan. And I'm Joelle, and this is a double dose.